how to add blog categories in Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a blog and also add the, uh, let's say here, blog posts and blog categories into our Shopify store. The process is very easy and you're going to be needing the blogs and also the organization like uh, blog categories to your website because it is going to be, uh, let's say here, more attracting or traffic attracting to make more, um, let's say here, sales and website traffic. Now, what are we going to do is to visit our Shopify admin dashboard. As you can see, we are on it. And we are going to head over the left side of the screen. And you're going to see here this menu. So what are we going to do is to select from here, sales channels. And you are going to select online store. Once you are here, you're going to see here the uh, different elements. So we are going to choose from here, blog posts. And then we are going to see normally this page. If you haven't already created some uh, blog posts, you're going to find it here uh, blank or uh, as you can see, uh, empty. So we are going to click on create blog post. And then we are going to set up the title. So what I'm going to do here is to head over chat GPT and we are going to get some help from it. So write me, write me a blog article about, let's say here, uh, something like mobile phones or smartphones, smart phones, smart phones and we are going to wait for uh chat gpt for o mini to respond now what i'm going to do is to put the title so we are going to put maybe this one the evolution of the smartphones now then we are going basically to copy and paste all of the, as you can see, the elements or the text. So we are going to paste it here. So now everything is set. You can go ahead and add some images if you want. And you have, for example, I'm going to create here an image. So we're going to create an image of uh, here, smartphone or smartphones. I'm going to wait for the image. I create an image by I certainly help imagine a scene. So why this is set? So I, I don't get it. So doesn't matter here. We are going to head over Google. So I'm going to put in Google. Then we are going to visit pixels. So this is the loyalty free image sources I have. So for example, phones. I'm going to put here phones and see for example just like that i'm going to get here a picture of the smartphones just like this then we are going to free download it get this copyright free image now what i'm going to do is to head over here add or insert an image and i am going to drag and drop the image into here so basically we are going to wait for it to be uploaded then we are going to click on insert so it is processing right there. It will not take a lot of time. Click on done, boom. And it will be adding the image. So here the image, I do not want it to be here, but instead I want it to be at the beginning. So we are going to have to put it in here. So I'm not going to do that. So it will take a little bit of time. So it doesn't matter here. I'm going to put it as this. So. Now I'm going to click on save. So the other thing is you have also a featured image, which we will need here to be added as a, let's say a banner. So we are going to head over here. I'm going to put the same picture. Now we are going to make the visibility of the blog here visible. Click on save. And we are going to see here, uh, post appear on your homepage. It doesn't matter. Now here, that thing that does matter is going to be uh, here. The image has been disappearing. I don't know why, but it doesn't matter. Now for the organization, 
this is the uh, most important part here. So you are going to set up the uh, author. And also here we have the blog. As you can see, we have this is set up to news. Now, the news means that the category of the blog is named or labeled news. How we can create the um, or add the blog categories. So we are going to have your actions. We're going to click on create new blog. And this blog is going to be titled something else. And that title is going to be the category of the blog. For example, here, tech. I'm going to name it as tech. And then we are going to click on save. So we are going basically here to have two blogs categories. If you are going to add another blog category, you can go ahead and click on create a new blog and name it. For example, here we are going to put in clothing and we are going only to click on save. And this is the blog, as you can see, categories. So when you are going to head over the themes, you're going to click on customize and we are going to visit the blog page. So we are going to head over the blogs. You're going to see the blogs here. And then we are going to see the preview of all the blog, as you can see, categories. And for the blog posts, they are going to be here set up as the posts it's, uh, themselves. So you are going to see here the um, subcategory of the blog set up. Now, this is how we can add the, uh, as, as you can saw, the blog categories. Go ahead and enjoy adding the blogs to the blog posts. You are going to see it right there. So then you can manage the blogs and see here the categories. So here it is not going to be um, a must to head over the blog post, create another blog post and create a category from it. But you can go ahead and add a blog here and put just the title and also set it up for example here i'm going to add something else like here um uh, money management 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 just like that and i'm going to click on here then how we can go ahead and create a blog post if you have added a blog post for example to the category you're going to add the blogs to them and then you're going only to assign the blogs so you're going to head over the blog post and then you're going to click on view blog post, not from here. So you are going to see the uh, page of that blog post, but you're going to click on it. And then you're going to click on the blog, select from here the category that you want to add it or assign it to. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.